So, have you seen any guys you think are cute yet? Actually, there's this one guy in my calculus class. Ooh, a senior. Who is it? Uh, Aaron Samuels. Wow. Are you trying to make the rest of us feel dumb? No, I I'm not trying to. It's just uh, happening. Oh. You can't no, like Aaron Samuels. No, that is bad, Regina's ex-boyfriend. Talk to your man yet? <laughs> I mean, I don't even know what to say to him. I always come off sounding like a lunatic. Do you like gum? Sure. Oh, I don't have any. I was just... Maybe just try to have one successful interaction per day. I like your shirt. <laughs> Thanks. It smells like sausage from the last time I wore it. Dear God, woman. Have you successfully been a functioning human being even once? But today I kind of, I don't know, I tried something and it just came to me instinctively. I'm totally lost. Can you help me? But I wasn't lost. I know exactly what Ms. Norbury was talking about. You pretended to be dumb so you could keep talking to a guy? I, yeah, it worked. <laughs> Function. You think the reciprocal Hey, my friend Chris is uh, having a Halloween party. Would you want to come to that? Mm -hmm. Ah! <laughs> I like your costume. Different from everyone else's. <laughs> cruel. I, I meant to say great, and then I started to say cool. Okay. I think you and Aaron would be a really cute couple. Really? Yeah, I just said so. Don't be thirsty. Okay, so you know that most people are cute? Yeah, I invented her tonight. She has a huge crush on you. <laughs> really? She took him back. She took Aaron back. Of course she did. Now you know Regina George is not your friend. We are your friends. And we're gonna make her pay. Katie, would you please tell him that his hair looks sexy pushed back? Your hair looks sexy pushed back. Yeah. I end up with Aaron when she's gone. Yes, bitch. I think I need a tutor. I could tutor you if you want. I don't get any of this. Nice job, Katie. Sure, it seems like you get it. She totally cheats on Aaron. <laughs> Every Tuesday she says she has college prep, but really she's hooking up with Shane Omen in the third floor janitorial closet on the bags of sawdust that they use for barf! And I'm only telling you because you're such a good friend. Hey, do you have time to go over derivatives for a minute? Oh, um, no, not today. I'll, uh, see you in Calc. She's just grouchy because if I broke up with her. He did? Someone told him about Shane. Should I, um, text Aaron and congratulate him? No. no. Your mama's going away, you should have people over. No, I'm going with her. Well, if you have people over, you could invite Aaron. <laughs> Is this you holding a crocodile? Oh my god, don't look at that. That is so embarrassing. No, it's not. It's awesome. I'm having a small get-together at my house tomorrow night. My mom's away, so... Okay. I'll be there. I think you should wear your hair however you want. It looks good both ways. Thank you for inviting me tonight. I think I've spent too much time being pissed at Regina. Yeah, you really have. No more liars. I would never lie to you. I mean, I did lie to you once. But you are totally gonna laugh when I tell you. Tell me what? I pretended to be bad at math to get you to help me, but I'm not bad at math. I'm actually, I'm actually really good at math. You're the one who's only kind of okay at math. Why wouldn't you just talk to me? Because of Regina, because you were her property. Her property? Shut up, not her property. Don't tell I... me to shut up. What? Aaron, sit down. 
You are a clone of Regina. <laughs> Sweet. But I know you didn't write that whole book yourself. Are you gonna tell Mr. Duval who did? No. I'm trying this new thing where I don't talk about people behind their backs. Getting hit by a bus seems like enough punishment. What is my fault is the way I treated my friends. I used you and I lied to you and I'm, I'm so sorry. The jacket looks uh, really good on you. Thanks, it has a pocket inside for a calculator. What? Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Welcome back, nerd.